Oh, for our lovers scene now. Oh, Cyrano, where are you? Where are you, Cyrano? I'm here, maiden. Look down. Oh, there you are. Yes, yeah, amazing, isn't it? Yes, you're so small from up here. I know, my altitudinally challenged woman. I'll fare you this fine evening. Oh, I'm doing so well. I've been waiting for you. Well, I'm here now to romance you. You're going to romance me? That's what I just said. Pay attention, you beautiful, daft woman. Well, listen, if you think I'm so beautiful, I'll, I'll ignore the other comment. Draft. Tell me, there's, there's a draft. Tell me, tell me about my eyes. Why your eyes are like, like the ocean. The ocean. The ocean. They're deep and they're full of delicious fish. <laughs> and fish, are, fish are brain food, my dear. Oh, so you're saying I'm smart? Indeed, you are. Like the ocean. Like the ocean, full of smart fish that never get caught ever. Well, I'm slightly confused. <laughs> I don't know if I like being like the ocean, but if you say so, Cyrano. I say so every time. <laughs> tell me more. Oh, I could talk about any of your features. Pick one. Oh, oh, tell me, please. Tell me about my hips. Your hips are like... Unicorns! Unicorns? They love their pointy. Hardly matter. They're white like alabaster. And I see them frequently frolicking through the fields. Try on, try on, try on. And there's a frequent like musical accompaniment and narration by Christopher Lee. Oh, I believe oh you see that movie? Good. I believe my heart is going trollum, trollum, trollum right now. But Cyrano, please, please, one more thing, please tell me about my thighs. Your thighs? My thighs, please tell me. I very well just speak of your thighs. thighs. Your thighs are like. It's, you're ahead of our time, madam. You're so far ahead of our time, you're convenient. <laughs> and people will make a market on your thighs in gasoline. Oh, well, Cyrano, I'm going to come down and open the door before you can take me now. Excellent. <laughs> Give a round of applause to our wonderful new lovers. Yes, we have a time machine, folks. And that is how you tame a shrew.